to the hike in holiday travel as millions of Americans are taking to the skies and roads to get away one last time before the unofficial end of summer. This is a live look at New Jersey Turnpike next to Newark Liberty Airport. The TSA says it will screen 14 million passengers between now and next Wednesday with today being the busiest day. Eyewitness News reporter Tom Negevin takes a closer look at the road trips that are already underway. Traffic here really picking up over the course of the morning. Well over half of Americans surveyed say they plan to go somewhere this holiday weekend, and the vast majority of them will get there by car. Starting dark and early this morning, travelers were fueling up and hitting the road, trying to beat the Labor Day rush. New York traffic is brutal, so I try to get by New York early as I can. Yes, very early after all. Should be in traffic all day. The Johnson family's in the middle of a long haul, over 500 miles from Raleigh to New Haven. I wish we were going to the beach, but we're going for a hockey tournament. 137 million Americans plan to travel somewhere this long weekend, 36% of them by car, many for this reason. Family trip, you know, going to check on relatives. I know we're going to, you know, probably have some challenging traffic going through New York, but it should be smooth the rest of the way. And just in time for all that travel, a gift at the gas pump here in the Garden State. The price of fuel dropping a full cent to 378 a gallon. That's a nickel below the national average on the Jersey.